Every now and again, a day will declare its own theme. No one, no one in each of these individual stories knew that there was going to be other stories out there of a similar nature. But today's common theme, be sure the kid's not around here, penis stories. I mean, I'm not kidding you. I got five stories here that directly involve the wang. Like the brain bones connected to the wang bone. All right. And the brain bone's not very smart. Matt just got visibly uncomfortable. Why? No I think because between me and the small the wind child, is blowing he's, this just, way. he's very, very uncomfortable. Would, right are now. you uncomfortable if I if I say uh, male appendage around Kirsten? No. Is that really? Like, I would hope not. That, that phrase is woman. cool. Yes. No, I understand. She's a grown woman. I know. She can she can give or take her own amount of penis jokes. I I I, 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 I take what you're saying and I agree with it. Uh, I just you know uh, have, have so been indoctrinated with the KLBJ uh, t- training, the sensitivity training, that every time we did the the handoff to Kirsten, uh, I was always just like anything she said anything or played anything. I was like, don't just you're gonna hurt her feelings. Damn it, we're all gonna get fired. <laughs> just do it. And here we are. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we kick off this... Not my fault. (laughs) No, not at all. (laughs) This pantheon of peen (laughs) with Shopper rubs his peen. (laughs) You can't can't wimp out in the middle. All right. On store's pepperoni, puts it back on shelf. No. What store? Tell me what store right now. Boston, New York man was arrested Wednesday on charges with a pup... With public lewdness for allegedly rubbing a grocery store's packaged pepperoni stick on his exposed penis and then putting it back on the shelf. Kirsten, you were in New York on Wednesday, weren't you? Uh, I was in New York on Tuesday. Oh, thank God you're a vegetarian. (laughs) John Allison, 41 years old, had a sudden late night craving for fondling cured meat, so he drove to the Hannaford Inn Messina and proceeded to do his thing. Oh, he didn't work there? He left it covered, though, right? It was packaged. He wasn't covered. He He was uncovered. But the sausage was. I'm assuming so. I would think it would be wrapped in some sort of... It does say the store disposed of the pepperoni. <laughs> Just to be safe. Yeah. You have to. I mean, that's a guy. Got up in the middle of the night, went to a store to pepperage his farm, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Next up. I'm not kidding you. All these were on the news today. Teen bites boyfriend's penis over what? sex refusal. Really? Oh, God. When her amorous advances were repeatedly rejected by her live-in boyfriend, Crystal, spelled with a K, hmm. Harrison, allegedly bit his penis in retaliation. The dispute continued outside the residence, where Harrison allegedly slapped her bow in the face, then spit in his facial area. Well, what did she say? After the biting, you can pretty much do anything you want. It's kind of like, all right, we're not going to get worse than that. It's not going to get worse than punishment A. I think every girl's probably had a flash of anger where you think about doing that. What? You don't actually. No, nobody. You don't actually follow. You never thought of that. But like a flash of anger when you're at the movies and like later I'm going to bite his penis, (laughs) or a flash of anger like when it's there and you're like. Flash of anger when it's there. What's happening? Where did this story happen? This was. Florida. Oh, was it Florida? Florida. So maybe not every girl, just a lot of the ones in Florida, yeah. 